Today I'm gonna go over how you can program more realistic slides in Odin where you can also control how quickly and to what notes you are sliding exactly. After that, I will show you a MIDI example that a Solomtones user sent in and where they asked me to help improve the MIDI for them to maximize the realism. I think there's a lot of little tricks you can actually do to take your MIDI from right here to right here. There are two ways to slide in Odin. There are the key switches, which are pre-recorded slides, and then you can also make them manually. So first I'm gonna show you the pre-recorded slides right here. So as you can see, it is simply the note we want to play with then the key switch right under it. And it's very important that the key switch is actually pressed in by the time you put your note here. So make sure it doesn't come late. If I were to put this key switch right here, then this note will not know that it has to slide in time. So if I put it like this, that is fine. I could play it right now and it would work. But for safety, personally, I just like to have all of my key switches hit at the exact same time, because that way I'm sure that they will always hit. So let me show you right here. This is A sharp zero, which in the info pane tells you A sharp zero is a slide fast. So right here, this will now do a fast slide. <laughs> Next, we have this same note, and this time with B0, meaning slide slow. However, sometimes you may think, oh, I really need this slide to do something entirely different than what's pre-recorded. Of course, it is impossible for us to record every single slide from every single node to every single node at every single speed. That is humanly impossible. And so instead, it is very useful to just build those slides on your own. So right here, I actually built one on my own. Essentially, what we're trying to do is we start from G and we go to B. And as you can see, what I did is I have my G start right here. And then I have every single note between G and B interrupt each other because you kind of have to imagine how a slide would be played. Your left hand would move along the fretboard and you would slide into every single next note, but you would still have somewhat of a transition period. So if these don't interrupt each other, if there's no overlay, this will just sound like the notes being played after each other. However, if they are interrupting each other this way, and then you combine that with the tapping key switch, which is A sharp minus one. Again, I can click on info right here, tapping A sharp minus one. It will kill all of the attack of these notes in particular. And again, make sure that all of these notes are hitting here. And so this way, the only note that actually has attack is the very first one. Because as you can see right here, there's no key switch playing yet. So this will only affect these notes. And that would be the same if you are playing a slide. The first note you have to pick and the rest is basically still using the energy from that first pick to keep ringing out. So let me show you what that sounds like. And that just sounds like an awesome slide. So let me show you again. The pick attack was heard here. There is no pick attack here, but you still went through all the notes. They kind of interrupted each other. So you really felt that motion as it played. Now, next, I wanted to show you a riff that a user sent us, and this is straight from Guitar Pro. And you will notice Guitar Pro MIDI usually has a lot of things wrong with it before it starts sounding good. I'll quickly flash up on the screen what it looks like in notation. So, of course, there's going to be these slides that we still need to add. And then these lowest notes have to be palm mutes. But right now, straight from Guitar Pro, this sounds like this. <laughs> Of course, as you can hear, there's a lot of things wrong with this. The first and most painful is that these palm mutes have silence. And if you try to imagine what a real guitar performance sounds like, a guitarist can never create silence this abruptly. Even when you mute with your left hand or your right hand, there's going to be some noise because humans simply aren't perfect. So if anything, the performance you just heard is too perfect. But of course, it didn't sound like that. So the first thing we want to do is connect the note. So we connect them like that. And now it sounds like this. All right, that's a bit better. But as you saw in the tabbing software, these notes have to be palm mutes. So now we put all of them at 30 velocity and let's play it again. Next, I want all of these highest notes to actually be played at full power. And I want these chords here to be a little bit more realistic. So the higher notes are played a bit weaker because you are playing the bottom ones very strongly. Now, if you want this to be more strumming like you could also invert that. So these could be a bit weaker and these could be stronger again. 
So as you can see right here, I'm essentially faking the strength of your pick as it hits the notes when strumming. Now for the most interesting part, we're going to add the slides. So like I said before, we now have these notes interrupting each other, having a little bit of that overlap, but we are still missing the tapping key switch because right now you would have very strong pick attack on each hit. <laughs> Still sounding pretty good, but I really like that tapping key switch here to really sell it. So A sharp minus one right here. And again, make sure that the first hit is not being affected by the key switch. And now we should have a far more aggressive cool performance than earlier. Now for funsies, I also added Kraken hybrid bass right here for the bass. And I also added Mjolnir drums right here for the drums, along with Overload, our Clipper plugin on top of the drums. Just, you know, to have a more full fun result. So that's all. I hope you learned something. If you want to pick up your own MIDI instruments from Solemn Tones, you can go to solemntones.com or click on the link in the description. Enjoy.